<clears throat> What's going on guys, this is Burrs. I wanna to talk to you today about the Voltor Murr upper receiver. Now you guys have seen this in tons of different videos. I've had over 2000 rounds pump through this bad boy and I've used this on a precision rifle. You've seen this precision rifle in a ton of different videos in the past, including uh, ammunition tests and uh, other you know videos in relation to SPR and uh, the build of an SPR. And there's a reason I picked the uh, Voltor Mer, and that's what we're gonna talk about today. So what you're getting with the Voltor Mer is a super rigid uh, upper receiver. And that's what the one thing you're gonna look for in a uh, SPR or a precision rifle. That's why I picked it. And what this upper receiver gives you that most others don't is thicker walls. And you can kind of see that towards the back here. You can see it's just a little bit thicker than the lower, which is a, a bean firearms lower. Uh, you can see it's just a little bit thicker. So it has thicker walls than what standard uppers would have, giving it more rigidity, more strength, and more stability, uh, and uh, more accuracy. Now how this upper is made is of a, um, it's machined out, right? So this is a billet upper receiver. It starts out as a uh, 7075 uh, aluminum forging, which is just a block of steel. They go through, machine it all, and they actually finish it each one by hand. It's heat treated, it's uh, aged twice, and cryogenic treated. So you're getting a very, very stable uh, platform to build your rifle off of as far as the uh, upper receiver goes. You know, so I have over 2,000 rounds in this bad boy, uh, like I said, and I've had zero issues with it. You can see on this side, I'm gonna talk about the uh, forward assist. So when you buy this uh, Voltor Mer, you have two options. You can have either with or without the forward assist on here. I went with the uh, with the forward assist. Um, you can see that you know it's really well done. Granted, you're not gonna have the paint job I have on here because that's something I did. <laughs> but um, you know you can see that you know everything is just perfect as far as the machining goes. So what this comes with is M4 uh, feed ramps, and it's available like I said with or without the forward assist. It's compatible with all mil spec AR-15 parts and accessories, so you don't have to worry about anything you're gonna purchase. I've used it in conjunction with the AXTS. Uh, Raptor charging handle and a uh, young manufacturing match bolt. So we're gonna do the best with camera angles here, but as you can see on the inside, everything's machined uh, really well. Can't see any marks or tooling marks or anything like that. It's just pure, you know, beautifulness when it comes to looking at a uh, an upper. Um, you can see on the the walls there, just beautiful side walls. See towards the front here all the machining marks uh, that are not left. It's just precision, and that's what I wanted with my uh, with my upper here. As far as weight goes, you're looking at around nine and a half ounces. Uh, if you're looking at the Mer 1S, you're looking at eight and a half ounces. So there's about a one ounce difference, uh, depending on which model you get. Length is 7.657 inches, and the overall height is 2.121 inches. Um, like I said, I've used this for over 2,000 rounds. I've been plugging away with under you know three quarters of a minute of angle. Um, I really have enjoyed using this. Um, it's the reason I purchased it in the first place was for accuracy and for you know putting it on a precision rifle and having not to worry about anything. You know the reason I got this was for the fact that I, you know when I build stuff, you know I build stuff to work. I don't just go out and buy parts. You know you can go buy any part in the market, and uh, you're gonna find some that just suck. Voltar's name and the fact of, you know, just looking at the, the great machine work uh, that they do here, um, you know, I got something that I wanted to last uh, a long time, you know. Uh, I like to buy things and, and think of them as heirlooms for uh, future generations in my family. So, you know, getting this was definitely part of that because I knew with the Voltor name and the fact that it had thicker walls, etc., it was going to be a great upper to build a precision rifle off of and uh, that's what I got. Now since I have mine camoed out, you can't see this, but it does come in two different colors. You can get the FDE or you can get black, and I believe that's gun coat is what the uh, coating they're using for that. So there really isn't too much more to talk about other than you know it's worked, it's worked really well. I really uh, enjoyed using this. I've had zero issues whatsoever. Like I said, I've used this in conjunction with a uh, Young Manufacturing na uh, National Match Bolt and a uh, AXTS Raptor uh, charging handle and I've had zero issues. So to wrap it up, if you guys are looking for a great upper to use for like a precision rifle or just in general to uh, build a you know rifle that you know is going to work and you don't have to worry about any of the parts that you're putting on there, uh, go ahead and take a look at the Voltor Mer upper. Uh, it's like their uh, modular is what I believe that stands for uh, as far as the upper goes but I would definitely take a look at this. It's definitely worth the money and uh, if you have any questions or anything let me know. If you guys have 
a Voltor Mer upper or uh, anything Voltor related, go ahead and put it in the comments down below or better yet, make a video about it. And until next time, later.